For most people, a budget CPU cooler always means a nice and strong air cooler that takes care of all their cooling needs. But what if you simply wanted or needed an AIO that doesn't cost an arm and a leg and performs just as expected? In that case, the ID Cooling Frostflow X240 Snow may just be the right answer. ID Cooling is on the forefront of making high-quality budget AIOs in a way that Montec is making PC cases and Thermalride is making air coolers. The ID Cooling Frostflow X240 Snow did concern me, considering how low its price is. I was suspicious of its performance and build quality and whether or not it's a good idea to go with it. Thankfully, it delivers. It can easily cool CPUs of up to 200 watts of TDP with little effort. I wouldn't recommend using it with power-hungry high-end chips, but it works well with CPUs that have more stable clock speeds. CPUs like the Ryzen 7 7800X3D and i5-13600K are some of the best pairings for this cooler. Although I've said nothing but praises, the Frostflow is, after all, a super budget-friendly cooler. With budget products, there is always at least one compromise, which, in this case, are the fans. I generally don't have much of an issue with these because they operate well, especially given their budget price, but they do get quite loud at high RPMs. They are officially rated at 35.2 decibels and stay quiet during gaming, but if you stress your CPU, you'll definitely be able to hear their high-pitched sound. Another annoyance is that the lighting on these fans is controlled by a single color LED, which can't be turned off. The build quality of the fans is also simply passable, which is a shame considering the high quality of the pump and the radiator itself. If you really want a no-frills experience with this cooler, you may need to invest in high-quality aftermarket fans, either from Noctua, Be Quiet, or Arctic. I don't recommend doing that, though, because at that point, you're better off buying a more expensive AIO instead. Even with the stock fans, you'd be hard-pressed to find a cooler that's priced so low with this level of cooling and build quality. For comparison, there are basically just two options. You could either go with a high-quality air cooler or the Thermalright Frozen Edge 240, which is the only other AIO in this price category worth considering. Air coolers like the Thermalright Peerless Assassin 120 are a solid choice, as it offers great cooling performance at a lower price point. But the downside is that it's massive in size and won't fit in smaller cases. And since the Frostflow X is a liquid cooler, it can sustain lower temperatures for an extended period of time without the fans becoming loud. The ID Cooling Frostflow X240 performs a bit better than the Frozen Edge 240 and is only properly beaten by the Frozen Edge 360. However, for the price of the Frozen Edge 360, I would jump to the Arctic Liquid Freezer 3 instead. In conclusion, for around $50, the ID Cooling Frostflow X240 is one of the best budget AIO coolers. It's an easy choice for anyone who needs a liquid cooler for their CPU, but only has the budget of an air cooler. It's sleek, well-built, and for its price, it really makes it tough to choose anything else. To sum up, what I like is that it's a water cooler at the price of an air cooler, and the great build quality. On the downside, low quality fans, and it gets noisy at high RPMs. Ratings. Design and aesthetics, 8 out of 10. Cooling performance, 8 out of 10. Noise, 7 out of 10. Features, 8 out of 10. Value for money, 9.5 out of 10. For an overall rating of 8.5 out of 10.